the Natchez boys and girls had an opportunity to extend their seasons tonight. The Natchez Lady Tigers in the state semis since the first time since 2012 for Natchez and coach Andy Snyder. That was the last of three state titles they won with the Patton sisters, but facing undefeated Dodd City tonight and the Lady Hornets were tough. Look at this journey Hilliard. She's going to kick it back out to Kylie Graves. She buries the three ball from the corner pocket and Dodd City still attacking. Here's Danny Backus throws it to J journey Hilliard and this time she's going to bounce it to Allie Priest and she lays it in down low for the Lady Hornets. Natchez folks fought very hard, but points were hard to come by tonight, especially in the second half. They end up falling in this one 65 to 20. The Lady Tigers end their season at 19 and 4. These girls, have, they've been competitive all year as far as basketball. We got a late start. Uh, most of these kids played volleyball and we're on the state championship volleyball team uh, and then take a group and go to the state tournament with a, a group. That's pretty, uh, pretty amazing group. Uh, when we had to battle the elements just like everybody did. Um, but the kids have battled all year. They just got, a, got beat by a better team tonight. Meanwhile, the Natchez boys out in Coppers Cove, they fall to Rock Springs 76 to 58. Tigers wrap up their season at 14 and 8. Girls private school ranks. This was last night out in Arlington. The Bishop Gorman Lady Crew couldn't quite get past third ranked Lubbock Trinity Christian. Falling 51 to 35, Coach John Froelich's Gorman squad ends a tremendous season at 26 and 7.